Welcome to another episode of Black and Blue. Yes, Black and Blue. And mm -hmm. today's episode is uh, uh, dealing with clothing. We're we're just calling it clothed, mm -hmm. right? Clothing. I mean, clothing is kind of a, a big deal. You yep. kind of need it. Mm -hmm. and, every uh, day. Yeah, every day. <laughs> and what's really fascinating is actually at the, at the end of the Gospel of Luke, right before the Ascension, uh, clothing is talked about, mm -hmm. which is not really expected. Um, actually. There's a lot of unexpected stuff going on in the Gospel of Luke at the end of uh, his Gospel. You have Jesus who uh, just uh, bled and died, and he rose, and he met with uh, his disciples, a little meet and greet with the freshly resurrected Jesus, and uh, he tells them, uh, you know, that they're going to go, and they're going to preach repentance and the forgiveness of sins to all nations. What you would expect after that is what, Deaconess? Okay, go. Go, go. Class dismissed. Scram. Off. <laughs> Make like a tree and get out of here. <laughs> uh, back to a future reference. Uh-huh. Yeah, so I'm, uh -huh. I'm dating myself now. Uh-huh. That's okay, though. Don't right? worry, we won't make you get back in your DeLorean. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just glad you went with that one. Okily dokily. There we All go. All right. Um, so, yeah, and, and, uh, and he tells them to wait. He tells mm -hmm. them to hunker down. After, like, you know, bleeding, dying, and pulling off that third day rising, he says, wait. Wait for... Here we go. Wait for... Wait, wait for... Uh, the Holy, Holy Spirit, Spirit to be clothed with power from on high. Can you mm -hmm. read that for us, Deaconess? I will. Thus it is written that the Christ should suffer and on the third day rise... From the dead, and that repentance and forgiveness of sin should be proclaimed in his name to all nations, beginning from Jerusalem. You are witnesses of these things, and behold. Behold! That's a big behold right mm -hmm, there. Mm -hmm. That's like, looky, looky, yeah, yeah. big neon sign. Yep. Check this out. Uh huh. And behold, I am sending the promise of my Father upon you, but stay in the city until you are clothed with power from on high. Stay mm -hmm. that. It's kind of a, <laughs> unexpected. Mm -hmm. um, so, uh, why do they need to be clothed with power from on high? Why do they, why do they need to be wrapped in the Holy Spirit? Yeah, well, I mean, one, we remember where they've been so far. Really scared disciples. Yeah, really. You're, you're getting a lot of um, help. Actually, mm -hmm. we need help in the Christian life. Mm -hmm. The Christian life is work that is humanly impossible to do. Mm -hmm. And the many and various vocations that we have, the many hats that we wear as Christians, right? Mm -hmm. We can't do it by ourselves. Mm -hmm. And the apostles can't do what they're about to do by themselves. Mm -hmm. And so they need to be clothed for three reasons, at least, that we can see mm -hmm. that we're going to talk about, at least for this uh, short video. Yeah. Uh, the first reason is... Um, Clothing, it, it covers. It covers. Them. It covers. That's mm -hmm. the first C. Mm -hmm. uh, the second uh, C is... Clothing comforts us, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. And the third one, uh, third C, is kind of a made-up word. So just, you know, just, just run with it. Roll exactly. With it. Yeah. Confidences. Confidences. Yes. Clothing confidences, well, especially the Holy Spirit clothing, mm -hmm. uh, confidences us. Mm -hmm. So covers, comforts, confidences. Let's go with number one, numero uno, right? Mm -hmm. Clothing, the Holy Spirited clothing. Uh, covers us, and they mm -hmm. needed to be covered. The mm -hmm. apostles did. Mm -hmm. What yeah. needed to be covered? I think. Uh, oh. Well, look at all that that happened. I mean, you mm -hmm. had uh, three strikes, and you're out, Peter, with the three denials. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, and, 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 and Thomas. And, yeah, and Thomas. Yeah, who he, he is going. This, unless I see the wounds, yeah. I won't believe. Yeah, he's yep. he's uh he's from Missouri, of course, right? The show me state. The show me state. Yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> that that is where he's from, of course. Uh huh. Um, where my mom's from too. So you, know. you have James and John. You know, they were trying to duke it out for uh the number one, number two spots mm -hmm. uh among Sit the, on the right the, hand, the among left the hand. disciples. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yep, mm -hmm. yep, yep. Uh, so you have the, you know, the power plays going on. And the forgetfulness. I mean, Jesus says three times that he's going to die and rise, and they really kind of missed they ever it got back, a few times. Yeah, they, they never really got past the whole death part. Mm -hmm. It's like they, they, they stopped hearing. Mm -hmm. Exactly. <laughs> um, yeah. They were all three strikes and you're out. Oh, really? Pretty much, yeah. I mean, they have lots of shame, <laughs> lots of guilt. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, they probably don't feel up to the task. Mm -hmm. uh, none of us would. 
Right. Um, so they need uh, all their pass failings and mm -hmm. flailings and uh, and just flops to be uh, to be covered. Mm -hmm. And that's what the Holy Spirit is doing as he covers them on the day of Pentecost. Mm -hmm. Of course, that's when they're going to be clothed with power from on high, right? Clothed mm -hmm. with heavenly power mm -hmm. uh, to do work here on earth with Jesus. Mm -hmm. uh, they will have all of their past flops covered. Mm -hmm. You know? So they know that they are forgiven. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And so, I mean, what a comfort that is, that you're covered with Jesus, that he's with the, by, with power from the Holy Spirit, that you are... Enough! Up. Enough! Yeah. Enough! Enough! Right? <laughs> right. They are enough! Mm -hmm. and, that's, and the same goes with us, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, we can all look at our past and really just be mm -hmm. paralyzed. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and really just... Uh, stuck. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't want to move forward. Cause what if I'm going to flop again? What if I'm going to fail again? How I don't know what's ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Realized is a really good word. And so, I mean, that's where that second C comes in that comfort because then, um, the Holy spirit, he's, he's our traveling companion. He is wrapped around us and he knows what's coming when we don't, I mean, when we are going into the unknown, it's scary. We don't want to move forward. What if I, what if I trip and fall? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, and, and, and obviously the disciples, the apostles really needed that uh, comfort of knowing they were not going alone. Yeah. Cause I yeah. guess it, they went a few places, right? Yeah, like, I mean, they only went a couple miles, right? Uh -huh. I mean, I they mean, went hundreds India, of miles into places Rome. that were not really, um, let's say friendly to mm -hmm. Christians, mm -hmm. uh, as you, uh, children know, brothers and sisters in Christ, uh, the apostles, um, I, I'm pretty sure they, they, they mostly died a martyr's death. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it was yeah. all but one. Yeah. yeah all yeah. but one. <laughs> uh, and, and, you know, exiled, uh, on Patmos wasn't, you know, mm -hmm. being like in the Bahamas nope. at some all inclusive, uh, you know, resort. <laughs> nope. Not at all. Um, so that really wasn't that much fun. Mm -hmm. Uh, so they go into the unknown with the with comforted. the Holy Spirit, the mm -hmm. Comforter, mm -hmm. yeah, wrapped around them, the traveling companion, mm -hmm. and uh, and what's really beautiful is Psalm one for me is uh, we're told that the Lord knows the way of the righteous, but notice the righteous don't know. We don't we don't know the way, but who knows the way? <laughs> Our Lord does, mm -hmm. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. And so the apostles could go into the unknown, knowing that someone had a roadmap. Mm -hmm. That the Holy Spirit had come alongside them and uh, is leading the way. He's leading the way. And the same mm -hmm. with us, right? Mm -hmm. Every morning we wake up, we make the sign of the Holy Cross and say, in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. And it re reminds us that we're marked as one redeemed by Christ mm -hmm. the crucified. It reminds us that, you know, we have a Father who dotes. And delights and in delights us. And delights in us, mm -hmm. right? He, uh, he says, you are my beloved child with whom I'm well pleased. And we're wrapped in the Holy Spirit. Mm-hmm. We got a traveling companion on our, you know, the day we were baptized. Yeah. And he's always been by our side. Actually, the word mm -hmm. paraclete mm -hmm. means uh, called alongside one, right? Mm -hmm. He's the mm -hmm. one who's called alongside us mm -hmm. and he gets to walk with us and take us by the hand and lead us in the way that he knows best. Mm -hmm. Now, mm -hmm. we may not always like where we go, <laughs> but we have uh, the comfort of knowing that the comforter is with us and he mm -hmm. will lead us in the way we are to go. Mm -hmm. And so, I mean, that gives us confidence. Yeah. It oh. confidences us yeah, it does. to go forward um, because we have the Holy Spirit leading the way and uh, it doesn't depend on us. That takes off a lot of pressure. And how did, they, how did, how did uh, the Holy Spirit going with the apostles confidence them, especially in their speaking and preaching and teaching? Yeah. Goodness. I mean, the Holy Spirit gave them the words to say in all these different um uh, all these different situations, those different countries that they went to, the different, you were talking about hostile environments. Mm -hmm. And I mean, ultimately the Holy Spirit was the one, uh, none of their words were in vain because yeah. the Lord always, uh, his word doesn't return empty. Isaiah 55, right? Exactly. His word doesn't return void. Mm -hmm. It achieves the purpose for which it's it, sent. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. 
It is spirit-filled word. So. Yeah, holy spirited, <laughs> life-giving, uh-huh. life-renewing, life-restoring word. Yep, absolutely. Powered from on high word. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't just, you know, human speech. It was human mm-hmm. speech packed with a divine punch. Oh, right? man. <laughs> yeah. Salvation punch. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Gospel good news. So yeah. uh, they had then the confidence to, to preach and teach and share mm-hmm. Jesus, mm-hmm. Uh, knowing that that word mm-hmm. had the power to save. That word had the power to bring people out of darkness into God's marvelous light. That mm-hmm. power, uh, that word had the power uh, to forgive sins and release people from the power of big bad wolf Satan. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And we have that same word, don't mm-hmm. we? Mm-hmm. We do. So yeah. the Holy Spirit confidence is us, right? Mm-hmm. In all of our conversations that we have. Yeah. From How, school to yeah. work, church, everywhere yeah. in between, home. Yeah. Yeah. Because sometimes mm-hmm. we're afraid to, to you know, talk about Jesus, aren't we? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why is that? Why is that? What? <laughs> Why can we be afraid sometimes? What Deaconess? will someone think? Or... I'm going to fail. I'm not going to say the right words. What if I, you know, I'll just stick my foot in my mouth. You know, it's, <laughs> oh, I mean, you can think of all sorts of different reasons of what could go wrong. <laughs> sure. Yes. Yeah. Afraid of losing a friend. Yes. Uh, afraid of, of not being liked. Uh, mm-hmm. Afraid of being rejected. Mm-hmm. Um, but we're given that confidence in knowing that the Holy Spirit uh, we'll use our words, mm-hmm. our witness, mm-hmm. uh, for uh, the good of people mm-hmm. and to the glory of God. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. That uh, we are just called to scatter that seed with reckless abandon. Yep. And the fruit that comes from that is not really on our, it's, mm-hmm. it's, it's not on us. Mm-hmm. That's a comfort to me. Mm-hmm. And, and me. And to Deaconess. <laughs> yeah. And me. We, we just yeah. scatter the seed with reckless abandon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, and the fruit that comes from that, it's 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 up to the Holy Spirit. Mm-hmm. It's unknown to us. It's known to God. So it gives us confidence mm-hmm. that uh, that our role is just to share, mm-hmm. witness, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, open our mouths and let the Holy Spirit yeah. uh, pack his punch. <laughs> yeah. And all this is really possible because we are clothed. You mm-hmm. know what we are given to do as Christians in this world is humanly impossible, mm-hmm. but we're given that power from on high, the Holy Spirit. He wraps us in the waters of holy baptism. And he Mm -hmm. continues clothing us, you know, as we hear the absolution, as we eat and drink the body and blood of Jesus, as we gladly hear and learn uh, the word of God uh, with with our devotion, with the sermon, Mm -hmm. right? With the scripture reading in church, that he continues to wrap us over and over and over again with himself, that power from on high, so that we are covered, right? Mm -hmm. And... Comforted. Comforted and mm-hmm. uh, and confidenced. Mm-hmm. He confidences us. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> um, so that we can, uh, you know, really know that uh, all our past failings covered. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have comfort in the present. We're not alone. Mm-hmm. And then uh, for the words we speak, we can have that confidence in knowing that our, uh, our God, Father, Son, Holy Spirit, will use that for uh, the good of man and for his glory, mm-hmm. that his word will not return void, mm-hmm. but achieve the purpose for which it is sent. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Aww. Yeah. So, so, so clothing. Cherry news. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is way better clothing that that we get at the Gap mm-hmm. uh, or wherever else you get your clothes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we have to wear Amazon, clothes. Amazon. Yeah. You know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is uh, this is the 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 designer label. Mm-hmm. We are dressed to impress. Mm-hmm. We're dressed to the nines. Mm-hmm. You know? mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. All of us wrapped in the Holy Spirit mm-hmm. for this beautiful work with Jesus in this world. Uh, so take heart, children. Uh, we, are, we are clothed, mm-hmm. covered, comforted, and the Holy Spirit confidences us. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Woohoo! 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 <laughs> Every day. Every day we get to put on the Holy Spirit. Yeah, so we get to go out in style. We, get to, I like that. We we're styling every day. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> so enjoy uh, being clothed with a power from on high, dear uh, dear friends, brothers mm-hmm. and sisters in Christ, mm-hmm. and, uh, and 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 always know that that by His wounds we are healed. Amen. Amen. Until next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.